Subaho Libnen Kifkan. And good morning, my friends, from a, another video here in Lebanon, specifically in Jezin. So where I'm at, if you guys didn't see yesterday's video, is I am actually in the mountains here, surrounded by beautiful forests here, really exotic trees, and in the cabin that we stayed at last night. So we've got the uh, squad slowly getting ready. Sabaho Kifi. Sabaho Nyeha. Nyeha, eh? Yeah. Oh, perfect. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a good uh, Arabic pronunciation yeah, there. Thank you. <laughs> so we've got uh, Mabel there and we've got the rest of the squad, I think, getting ready. we got Fuad Kifak, bro. Sabaho. Sabaho. How are you? <laughs> good, bro. How was your first night in the cabins? It's good. Yeah. Sleeping over here is really like, when you sleep in the mountains, it's like a whole, it's like a different level. It's yeah, really comfortable. Wallah. There's nothing like it, you know? Yeah. I mean, look at this place. So a big uh, merci katir chaye because for, for found, what? found these places. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, bro. So, uh, yeah, guys, actually, these uh, cabins have 24-7 power, too. So the nice part is at night, anyways, it gets cool, so you don't necessarily need the AC. But uh, you can see a little bit more of this place now that we are awake. Obviously, in yesterday's video, we arrived in the night, so you couldn't see it. But, like, you know, you just have your, your true Lebanese forest cabin getaway. And so it's been really nice to... Uh, start out our first tonight last night in Jazeen and I'm really excited to share with you guys what we're going to be exploring today all over the Jazeen area probably start out with some food maybe a little coffee there and that's how we'll get going Sabaho Kifkan that's some good Arabic right there so we've got Will and Maria you guys probably saw them from the last video and we're gonna be doing some exploring today Yalla well, I think it's time. I don't know about you guys, but Bide Turwi'a. That means I want breakfast. Oh, the Arabic's actually coming along. I'm still a long way from actually being able to have some conversations, but enough to make you guys think that I am learning a bit. Oh, now we can see the obstacle course a little bit better here. So, wow. Looks like we've got some ropes you can cross. Bridge right there, rock climbing wall, and uh, Sabaho. Oh, who's going for the kick? Well, bam! <laughs> Sabaho! Kifkan! I don't, I don't know if I'm very good. We can send one over here, though. Oh, oh we got one there. Oh. There we go, y'all. You know? that, that's, uh, that's, that's some football right there. Shufak! <laughs> what is that you smell right now? Zatar. Oh, yeah, this is Zatar and Here, guys, or oh, here, yeah. Uh, no, no, the bakery in Jazin. Uh, there is one that I know it's called Zaha. Zaha. So, so it's a small place. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Are we going? Uh, yeah. We just need to have coffee. Hi ho, hi ho! Off to the bakery we go. The furnace al Jazin. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. No? no. What is it, bro? Uh, put it in Zaha. Put it in Zaha? Yeah. Yalla. So, Fouad, tell us some uh, facts about Jazeen on the spot. Um, it is a state uh, located in southern Lebanon. Around it, there is Merjayoun, Nawatiye, and the Shouf area. You can see, like, over there, you see the mountains on your left. It touches Shuf over there, like far oh, over that there. close to Shuf? Yes. Wow. Uh, Jizin is kind of a uh, natural reserve for Shaza the Sindian trees, the pine trees. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, pine? Do we have cedars of God here? No, we don't have cedars. The cedars, uh, there's cedars in, uh, in Shuf area, in Aris uh, and then Ehden. Oh, okay. So we're not that far from the cedars then? Oh, uh, yeah. Like 30 minutes? Yeah. I don't know. Something like that. It is located in Baruch, in, uh, in uh, Shuf area. It's a natural reserve for the cedars. Oh, check the trees. Oh, wow. On the main road, you'll see the beautiful view. Man, it is a beautiful place, Jazeen. Yeah, is this uh, Lebanon's most beautiful landscapes? Yes. Yeah? Yes, wow. indeed. Wow, I'm excited. We're gonna be checking out so many of these landscapes, guys. Also making it over to the famous waterfall here. One of the actual first photos when I was deciding to come to Lebanon was um, of Jazeen, of this really, really picturesque waterfall. So you'll wanna stick around in the video to make sure you guys don't miss out on that because that waterfall alone will have you minds blown.
Ah, and we have arrived. Oh. All right, guys, so we just arrived to the city center of Jazin, and we're gonna be going to this bakery that Fuad has been to about three years ago. That was the last time he was in Jazin, right before the uh, pandemic hit, or actually probably a solid year or two before the pandemic hit. And uh, he said, this is the spot to go because it's a family owned, very, very old bakery. So he said, uh, we're gonna be in for a treat. Ooh. Sabaho Manusha, Jibne Uzata. Sabaho, Kifak. Oh, that smells delicious. Zatar or Jibne? Uh, no cheese, just Zatar. Oh, Zatar. We can bring from the store cheese and he'll make us cheese, but oh, yalla. Zatar is the go to. Arba? Arba? Or Hamsed? 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 The lemonade is picking up on it. Yeah, Arba? No, yeah, if you want to tell me Arba, I would have been like, what is that, 40? I know. That's when you know things are getting out of hand. When I'm correct in Lebanese. Arba? Arba? Chalas? Guys, you just witnessed that I corrected a Lebanese there. <laughs> well, I'm like Arba, I'm like Hamsid. <laughs> yeah, That's a good one. Yeah, exactly. Tell us, you're Lebanese. I'm Lebanese now, bro. Yeah. So, bro, tell me, what happened here to these garages? I don't know, they're old garages. Mm. Uh, like, look at the old buildings, even. Like, it's like the old Jazin downtown. Ah, uh, yeah, old Jazin. Yeah. How many people live in this city? Like 50,000? Uh, this city? Yeah, like the greater area. Uh, like, Jizin is a state, you know, with villages around it and everything. The number is variable. You yeah, know, yeah, that makes sense. It's not 100% accurate. Oh, ah, okay, sweet. So we're going to Jibna here. Bonjour, Kifa. Bonjour. Uh, Jibna here, yeah? Hamsid uh, Manusha, yeah. Oh, we're getting the full-on slicer then. Mm -mm -mm. That looks like some Taib cheese there. Is that right? <laughs> sure, bro. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah. Was that right or is it Taibe? Uh, Taibe. Taibe. Ah, oh, I got it wrong then. All right. Hey. Well, we tried to get it right. Very close. Mm -hmm. We're getting there, one step at a time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't get my Arabic lesson yesterday. That's why. Oh yeah, it's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I know, I know. <laughs> I didn't ask for it. It's gotta be like five kilos of jibne. Oh, we're gonna toss that thing right up there on the slicer. Oh yeah. Some electric slicer right there. Oh, look at that jibne coming right off the slicer like that. Yum. Oh yeah. That looks fantastic. It's crazy how it slices it so perfectly there. Yeah. Uh, in your name? George. George. Uh, uh, Isme Mac. Mac. From? Uh, from the United States. You're from Jazin? Uh, it's a beautiful place. My first time here. Merci, Tir. Oh, uh, yeah. It was a small town. Mm. Small village. From 960 AD. 960 AD, wow. Yeah, around uh, 70 or 80 uh, people living here before. Well, only 70 or yeah. 80, wow. Now it's coming uh, 60,000. 60,000, wow. Yeah. Oh, so I was right, 60,000, you said 20,000. Yeah, I, I oh. said 20,000 based on the lecture. Jizin and uh, the environment. Oh, okay, the surrounding yeah. area, yeah. Uh, most of the people here are Christian. Yeah. Uh, there is uh, Jabal Rihan, mm. Shahid. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. There's no university still. No university here, yeah. No. There is two banks. Two banks. Uh, all my, uh, office for the ministries are here. Are here, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Electricity, twenty. Twenty-four-seven. <laughs> no, twenty. 
20 hours. hours ah, 20, 20 hours per day. That's yeah. really good. That's a flex. Yeah, 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 yeah. exactly. <laughs> Compared, because like the average city is what, like 17 hours with generators? Yeah, something like that. Uh, it's getting worse wow. time by time everywhere in Lebanon, the electricity situation. Very clean. Yeah. Very clean, yeah, I saw that. A lot of water. Yeah, good restaurants. Yeah, good restaurants, good uh, foods. Yeah, nice people. Yeah. Nice people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, what is Jizin yeah. like well known for the Jiziniyet, the yeah. kitchen yeah. set? Down. Yes. And the souk. Mm. Oh, there's a souk. Yeah. yeah oh. the you can ask for the haddad. Haddad. Haddad, haddad yeah. yeah. Haddad. How are they made? Like uh, from animal hordes? Yeah, sure, 100%. Mm. Wow. Uh, it's, 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 it's a rare skill here in Jizin. Ah, yeah. Jizinyet, we call them. Like, you know, the table set. Yeah, like yeah. Like the spoon, fork. Yeah, knife. yeah. Like the handle is made of animal horns and there's carvings. Oh, wow. Yeah. It is really amazing. That's such a unique place in Lebanon. Yeah, yeah, that is. The waterfall? The waterfall. Uh, not yet, but we're going to. Thank you. 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 so much. Nice to meet you. Welcome. See you. All right, so we got the jib there now, and we're heading back to the uh, bakery. And we're gonna make some delicious cocktail manouches. All right, so we got the jibne brought to Ray too. I love the Wow. Oh, we do. We can do them custom made. We can, like, oh, yeah? Oh, custom. Yalla, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, I wanna do mine. All right, we're getting them custom here. Oh, we're going right in here. So we tossed the flour right on there. And we're gonna, we're gonna take a look back here what we got going on. As you can see, we got the dough flying. Sabaho. Kifak. Wow, look at this oven. It is so hot down here. It's got to be like 45, 50 degrees down here working here. And he's just tossing all those things right out. And let me tell you, the smells in here are incredible. Wow, look at how much dough that is. Oh, ho, ho. you ever made a manusha before? No, it's my first time making a manusha. Actually, I'm dead? Wow, the Lebanese first time making a manusha. So we got them all ready here. Yeah. We got the Zatar, that's number one. Oh. Is this on your chase? Super fast. Uh, oh, yeah, there we go. This is the full process. Up, I ordered five. Four, four, four. Okay. Oh, the four? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Zatar u Jibne. Making my own Who would have thought? In today's video, we're going to be taking the Lebanese for her first time uh, making her uh, minutiae. You, you want cocktail, right? Cocktail, yeah. So we have to put Jibne over this one. Ah, uh, Jibne over this one, yeah? Yeah. That's how you make it the delish ones. Alright, what do you want to do? We make an extra man Ushe also? Uh, we have to add okay, one with cocktails. But then Hajjibne for a Zata. Can you want to do it? Oh, uh, no, you use it. Yeah, so we need more Jibne? Hey, hey, hey. Uh, we'll add one Zata. Hey, hey, Zata, come in. I'm the Zata. Yeah. Here we go, nice, nice eight pack of them. Oh, that's the best manouche. Oh, yeah. That's, how do you know which one is for Mac? Can you guess? Mm. Which one is for Mac? Mm. The most original one. Mm. The best of the best. <laughs> yeah. Cocktail. Alright, here we go. <laughs> so it is time to send these things right into the oven here. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, look at them just toss them right up there. And looks like we're going to be next in line. There goes the bread. And then another one. The bam. Wow, so they basically use these boards to slide them right in like a massive, almost like spatula. All right, first two minutias have been tossed in. And another one. Oh yeah, we got a little fresh bread. Who's gonna do the honors to open it? Go ahead. I feel like we're safe. Yeah. Me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay, I'm, holding a phone. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Who wants to start first? You open that up like you've opened those before. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no. yeah no, who wants to start? No, no mm, one? Do me. the honors? Yeah, no. Oh, look at mm. the face. Mm. 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 Oh, now that's a reaction. That's G -O -O yeah, that looks G W O D. And here's what we got going on right you there. Manisha, those are really cooked in, I don't know, maybe one minute. We walked away and they're already done. Can I tell that's the cocktail right there? All right, let's try out some of this fresh bread here. Mm -hmm. 
Mm, mm, mm. That is a nice little palate cleanser to get us ready for these delicious minutiae. And the Jibnes have arrived. Oh yes, this is gonna be incredible. How much was it? I know, I just need to know for the video. Oh, okay, 130. 130, alright. Oh. Deal. I'm closing this This is also for our buddy. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Good luck, bro. Thank you. Merci, Tir. It's all for you. Thank you, brother. Thank you. You got it. Thank you, baby. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah. Looking at the camera. Merci, Tir. Shufak. Oh, bro, this yeah. such an amazing place. Oh yeah, it is time to chow down. Bro. So guys, for uh, eight minutiae and that whole thing of bread, 130 was the total. So I want to say that's like five, six bucks roughly. So a really nice price. And this is where it is. So we're right downtown. There's no sign for this place. So if you want to look for it, just look for this entrance. Take a screenshot on your phone right now and you'll be able to just walk right down in there. Get yourself a delicious minutia. All right, let's go eat Sakten. Yalla. Oh yeah. This is like for a better address to know this direction. bakery direction. You see this uh, Jazin uh, municipality sign? Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. When you have, when you see it, you just go inside this alleyway. Right over here, over down there. this way, and you'll find it right there. Yep. Perfect. All right, she's got the goods, so watch her. She might finish all of them. <laughs> mm. <laughs> it's mine. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> What a nice guy, George, yeah? Yeah, such a nice guy. Well, All of them. It's very hot. <laughs> Maybe a good view, and after that, we'll go and drink some coffee. And then we'll cruise around Jazin. Perfect. Nice. That sounds like a plan. Very good, very nice. Very good, very nice. Very good, very nice. <laughs> All right, we have located a picnic spot. So right on the side of the road here, we have views of like, I believe those are maybe a bit of farmland, maybe some winery uh, trees down there. I can't really tell for certain. And these picturesque views. Oh. Subaho Lebnin. Sakten, bro. Habibi, bro. Habibi, bro. Wow. Look at these views. I would love to have a house just like that one. Kind of modern, kind of Lebanese, mixed with incredible views to wake up yeah, to in the morning. So we've got my specialty in there. Ah, oh, this one. Ah, uh, this one? Yep. Oh. Right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. You can see because the za'atar turns nice and greasy. Either. Mixing in with that cheese. Wow. Sakten. This is what we call a true Lebanese breakfast. I love it when that guy told us. Make your own manusha. Mm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh yeah, this is what we came for. Nothing like a fresh, delicious minutia that we even had to do the work ourselves to make this. Slightly. Yep. How is it? Delicious. Mmm. Mmm. So delicious. So delicious. How are you guys liking the uh, fresh minutias? Man. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Man, the bread. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Speechless. That's how good it is. <laughs> Was brewing up some sort of uh, significant idea about oh. how good it tastes. You know when you're sitting in nature having good food, I'm joking, it's really good. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Man, you can realize how much fresh the bread is. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. Mm -mm -mm. The chew on it's incredible. This is DIY. Mm -hmm. Do it yourself. All right, that did not take me long to finish it. We got the last bite. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Incredibly tasty. Exactly what we needed to start off the day. All right, after the picnic, it's time to go get some coffee here. 